channel. It is Vlogmas Day 6 and I'm so excited y'all. Please excuse how I look. I just got off work but I'm trying to make this video happen because when I get home y'all, I need to relax. I'm going to relax, edit this video, eat and I got some school work to do because it's finals week. Classes is so yeah. Hope y'all are enjoying the videos, the vlog day videos so far. I'm trying to not make it seem like I'm just doing sit down videos, but y'all, I work four, five days a week. Next week I work six days, so I'm gonna try to film all my videos this weekend. So please bear with me, y'all. I'm trying and I'm not trying to give up, but it's kind of hard because I, I'm struggling, I'm struggling. About the time I'm gonna be discussing five holiday things, and I'm gonna be telling y'all what I love about them and what I hate about them. Number one, y'all, Christmas music. <laughs> one Christmas music. I hate Christmas music because I feel like it's so like it's just not it. Like it's like it don't got enough hype in it. Like, don't nobody want to be listening to that little, I don't even know what you think, the carols and stuff. Like, don't nobody be want to listen to that? Like, I do love some Christmas music, but not, not, not all of them. Like, I can, I can be fine without the Christmas music. Like, it don't get me in the Christmas spirit for real. What I love about Christmas music is the black people Christmas music. Like, I love that type of Christmas music. Like, if I'm going to listen to it, I go listen to the black Christmas music because I know because the other Christmas music got lyrics in the Christmas music and do the research on why they call certain stuff what they call it and y'all don't want to listen to it either like and that shit sounds so real like that's just me being honest so yeah that's what I love Christmas music some music do get me the holiday spirit but majority of it don't y'all it's the traditions traditions because I feel like it gets repetitive like I feel like we is going in, we in 2023 going to 2024 and it is no reason why I was born in 03 y'all it is no reason why we still doing the same traditions from 03 when I was born like it's just no reason for that like and I think that's why I be so like so over the holidays because it's like I know how the, the stuff is about to go like this is what we about to do saying like yeah be tired of that like i'll be tired of the same thing like let's switch it up like let's add something new to it like let's we could always add like we could take the, the same tradition and make it a twist like thanksgiving food like so y'all know that everybody cook thanksgiving food on christmas stop let's do like a seafood boil like let's stop i'm tired of that like let's just switch it up like also another thing like that, that we could change about the holidays instead of us being at home every year let's go out of town like stuff like that like that's what i mean by the tradition being repetitive like we just constantly at the same people house sitting up in the same people face like every year like no let's take a vacation let's do let's let's do a seafood boil let's change the food up let's change the vibes like you feel me just that but what i love about the traditions is i feel like it just it brings like you already know like you know what to expect so it just brings the family closer and like just really bonding with your family like you know you know who gonna be around so you don't really gotta you know fake the fault but you know still enjoy time with your family so it is a good thing to keep the tradition but all i'm saying just add a little twist with it but y'all number three decorating oh my god i hate decorating because like y'all you okay so for me and my family we decorate before thanksgiving okay but we take it down right after christmas because for us we don't go to new year with our christmas decorations up for like we don't do that so like in for two months you take four to five days depending on how long y'all take to put up some decorations that don't even last you know i just hate putting up and taking down like the tree the tree is the longest part like the tree take at least an hour or two hours to put up 
with all the decorations. And then you gotta take your time and hand pick everything off the damn tree. Like that blows me. That that really blows me. And if you do outside decorations, I don't know how y'all do it because I can't. I cannot do that, y'all. Like it's no way I'm gonna sit out there and go put some outside all of the decorations y'all be having. Y'all be going crazy. And then you gotta take them down. Yeah, it's not for me. I'm gonna have to hire somebody when I get my house because I can't. About um the decorating is this it's so beautiful. Like it gets you in the spirit. You bond with your family to put it up. It just gets you in in a mood. Like you be so excited. Like it just it just changed the whole vibe. And that's what I love about it. Okay, y'all. Number four is the gifts. The gifting the gifts. I don't like gifting because for one people just automatically expect you to get them a gift because it's Christmas or it's the holidays number two I don't know what to get people for real like like, like off the real like what I'm gonna get people I don't like money and gift cards that's not my things I thought that just wasn't thought of so I don't like giving them type of gifts regardless if it's the holidays birthdays anything in general I don't like them type of gifts but like I just don't like shopping for other people. Oh, so yeah, you just get to see like when you're receiving gifts to giving gifts, you know, you just get to see how happy everybody is. Like even though it's a pain getting the gift, after it is what matters the most. Like the bonding of them opening, you getting the experience of how they feel, like the emotions behind it. Like you always gonna be able to experience that moment of you know watching them open the gift or what they got and how excited they was like that's one thing i can say i love about it. it's the gifting so that's what i'm excited about with the gifting so the last thing y'all number five is shopping like physically going out shopping in the black friday it's overrated i feel like and i don't like i don't like i like the experience of black friday but i don't like the idea of it like and I say that because people just go too far. Like, it's no way we should be fighting over something for Black Friday. Like, I get it. Everything's on sale. You you know, we in line. We doing this. We doing that. But fighting? Like, people just be overreacting when it comes to stuff. Like, I'm not about to fight over nothing. Like, you feel me? In, like, in a crowd. Being in a place where it's a big crowd. Because I feel like that's why stuff tend to happen. And when you have bigger crowds, bigger attitudes. Like, people just go crazy. People don't know how to act when they're in bigger crowds. I feel like that's just a trigger. Like, oh, you let me start. Like, you feel me? But, yeah, I don't like it. Like, I prefer the online shop during the holiday season because people be, lines be long. People be slow. People, people don't like coming to work. I just don't be getting it. Like, I don't get it at all. Now, what I love about shopping, like, physically going to shop in uh, Black Friday is the one, the deals. The deals is go crazy okay like i love the deals and two i do like black friday shopping because you do get the full experience like you know you be there when people go crazy and stuff even though it's not like that's not the point of it but it's just like you get the experience you actually get to go and go buy stuff instead of just doing online shopping and online shopping like you have so many deals as well so this video was not long at all but it was just my five i spoke on five things and i told y'all what i hate about it and i love about it about the holidays and how i feel so comment down below what's something you hate and you love about the holidays because i want to know but y'all yeah, thank y'all for watching i love y'all so much come back tomorrow for day seven and i love y'all so much bye